This is the third trip Missionary Flights International has made over the last week or so, bringing a total of 27 people from Haiti here to the Treasure Coast International Airport. But this trip, this trip was special. Amen. Amen. It's easy to understand why yeah. Wilner Augustin is so excited. <laughs> He hasn't seen his mother, Mariani Fleury, in six years since he left Haiti for the U.S. in 2018. That is about to change. Oh, it's exciting. I, 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 I can't wait to, to see her because it's been so long. Mariani still lives in Haiti in a town about 20 minutes outside of Port-au-Prince, which has been plagued by violence for weeks. No food. There is nothing. It's absolutely... It's, I had, there is no, no word to describe what's going on in Haiti. Wilner was able to arrange for her to escape the violence to catch a plane with Missionary Flights International to bring her to the Treasure Coast International Airport. I'm so happy I was able to do that. Now I can just have my mom come and hopefully I will be able to help some other people to come. Well, it encourages me that we to keep on doing what we're doing. I mean, if I hadn't seen my mom for that many years and she's able to come out and be safe, um, that's great. Finally, a little after 6 p.m., the plane touched down and Wilner saw his mom in person for the first time in years. A few agonizing minutes later, she made it through customs <laughs> and mother and son reunited. Welcome, welcome. It's so excited. There is no word to describe it. Mariani said she was so excited she had to hug everyone, even me, but she never strayed more than a few feet away from Wilner. God, just make it. We're so happy that now she's She's now, she's with us. Wilner tells me he's not sure how long his mother will be staying here in the U.S. He says it all depends on what's happening in Haiti. But he says for now, he's just going to enjoy the time he gets to spend with her. In Fort Pierce, Ari Height, WPBF 25 News.